Here we go. <laughs> All right, one very small glass of champagne. <laughs> no. Come on. No. It's Dad's best champagne. You're going to insult him. Expensive, very expensive. I'm not taking any chances with this thing. All right, thing. here. <laughs> Oh, no, I think I'll uh, follow Eden's lead and not take any chances. Well, I will so take it. I haven't had champagne in weeks, and I can think of no better reason for a toast. Well, I suppose at a time like this, somebody should say something eloquent. Well, since I'm the senior sibling, I guess maybe the job will Mason, fall to me, unless Mason, somebody... Mason. Maybe, maybe your father would like to do the first toast. See, see? That's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Thank you, thank you. I think I'll even have some of my good stuff. Well, I don't know about being eloquent or anything. I'm too uh, <laughs> choked up with pride and happiness to even be coherent. <laughs> the crew's needing to give me a grandchild means more to me than I can ever express. I'm sure Carmen feels the same way. Having grandchildren to leave behind gives you at least some hope of immortality. So let's hope this is the first of many. And this one has a long and happy and healthy life. Cheers. Yay! Cheers. <laughs> That's mine. Carmen? Well, my heart is so full. I know how much Eden and Cruz have wanted this baby and what wonderful parents they're going to be. The child will grow up to be loved and cherished. What better gifts can we give our children? <laughs> I'm looking forward to a long, rich life of babysitting. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Daddy. And now I want to know why you haven't told us before now. Yes, that's what I'd like to know. Well, the reason I didn't say anything was because I wanted to make sure that everything was going as well as can be expected and that nothing was going to go wrong. Good, and, and everything's fine, yeah. yes? Yes, yes, we, uh, we spoke to the doctor today and he assured us that there are no problems, so uh, we decided to, to, to break the, the good news. Thank you, I'm glad you... I would like a little more champagne. I feel like celebrating. You should be careful, okay? Please don't do anything. Don't worry. I'll be careful. And and listen, um, I sort of looked over at you, and you look kind of sad. And I hope you're not thinking about what happened. No, I mean I'm not sad. I'm so thrilled for you. Something so terrible happened to you, and something now so miraculous to follow it. I couldn't fish for anything more. Thanks. You're gonna have a baby, too, you know? I hope so. Changes everything so much. Mm -hmm. You're going to have a brand new brother or sister very soon, Mito. I mean to ask you, Mama, now that you've had a taste of this grandchildren thing, are you sure you're ready for another one? Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> Garmin. Sophia and I have started a grandparents club, and you are the founding member. <laughs> Chris and I were just talking about that. This is a beautiful day for all of us. Hmm. Sure you won't change your mind? Yeah, I'm sure. All right. I'm not going to let this stuff go to waste. Isn't this great? Oh, yes, it's wonderful. Except... Uh, never mind. Eden's been pregnant for five weeks. Yeah, that's uncomfortably close to the time of the rape, don't you think?